swimming and diving with their season coming to a close. I'm joined by head coach Pat Mead. Coach, now that it's been a week since the CAAs, how do you think they performed? Um, I, again, I still stay true that our guys did a great job. I mean, our men, especially our freshman men, they had a great meet. Um, the women, uh, I think there's definitely areas that we can improve on. And, you know, we've had team meetings both with the guys and the girls now. We've kind of recapped what we did right, what we did wrong this year. And um, hopefully from those team meetings, um, we'll start moving in a different direction. Um, as you can see, our kids are back at it right now. Uh, we still have our divers that are going to NC2A zones. We have Caroline Baker and Jeannie Ball. They leave this week to go to NC2A zones. So hopefully they can go up there and represent the team and the school very well. And we'll see what happens and see what, if one of them can move on to actual making the NC2A meet. Okay, now you had a big contribution from your freshmen, Matt Lowe and John Burr, who set records at the CAAs. What is it like to have a big contribution from freshmen? I, I think it's great. It's exciting. I mean, it, it gives us hope that as we move forward um, to next year, um, that we're going to even be better because when you have a strong freshman class as long as they do the work in the spring and in the summer then you know they're only going to be faster and we've got a good group of freshmen coming in for next year so we take what we've got returning plus the incoming and our men's team should be a whole lot stronger and we you know if you look at the points some people did some stuff this year and they've looked at how many points we gained we actually gained more points um, at the CAA competition than any other school. We gained close to 100 points from our scores last year. So we take that, combine that with a good freshman class coming in, you know, we should be able to start moving forward with the men in the CAA next year. Okay, now you said you have two divers headed to the zone meets this weekend. What does that mean for them? I think it's another great opportunity to compete. Um, you know, you're being able to compete at a national level. Um, that's always something that they should be proud of. Um, but I also think that it's, it's a great way to finish off the season. Again, we've got two seniors with Jeannie Ball and, and Caroline Baker. So last year um, they went and they didn't do as well, but the year before they were actually in the top 10. And basically it's anyone's game. If they go there and perform well, one of them could find themselves actually going to NC2As this year.